Welcome to the junction! Today I have got Sumiko Gurashi, so I am going to be opening an entire case of the Sumiko Gurashi Supermarket Remit. Are they Remit? I'm saying they are, and I'm not. They are! <laughs> okay, so I have this entire set, and this box means you get a complete set. There are eight boxes of super cute Sumiko Gurashi Supermarket stuff. Supa de otsukai! I got these for my birthday, which was not recently, by the way. It was like few months ago and I'm just now getting around to opening these. Here is my box. I don't even care who I get. Well, I obviously do because I'm going to get all of them in this set. So my first box is, oh gosh, they're so cute. They're so cute, guys. The only problem with opening Remint in this kind of setup is that I have to show you a bunch of little stuff. <laughs> the first one I got is the sausage sausage set he's making little like octopus sausages now i feel like i haven't played with or opened sumiko gurashi in so long i may forget their names which would be tragic also do i have the patience you're supposed to like cut out with scissors some of this little stuff to be part of it i'm so impatient guys i mean Okay, first of all, we have, I'm fairly certain this is just the cat, and his name is just Neko, if it is, which means cat in Japanese. I'm fairly certain that that's Neko. He's, like, been eating sausages, you can tell. He's got, like, a little bit on his face. You guys, this is tiny little package of ham. <laughs> no, you can get ham like this. Obviously, it looks like bologna that we have here in the U.S., but this is a very typical uh, ham, the way it comes in Japan in the deli. So funny, that little face. There's a little plate that you can put one of the uh, octopus sausages on. And now when I say octopus sausage, I am not talking about real octopus. I'm talking about a literal hot dog, you know, like they've cut to go in a bento that once boiled, it looks like a little octopus. So funny. Now at the end of the video, I am going to film everything so you can see the sets together on the table. So don't worry. The most important part of any octopus wiener setup is the literal little octopus wiener grill. <laughs> You guys, they're so cute. Not to mention absolutely delicious. I actually, I love Japanese sausages. And you're like, what's the difference? I don't know. I don't know why there's a difference. Just like so many Japanese foods, there just is, there's a difference. And I, oh, I love it. <laughs> that set's so cute to me. All right, next set. My next set just says snacks. Now there are some really cute things in this one because oh, some really cute things in this one. It just says snacks. So here it all is. Oh dear, it's one of these. I'm gonna have to like break out a whole bunch of stuff. Oh boy. Look how cute this little snail is. Oh, with the with the, the shopping basket. So cute. Does anybody know, does that snail have a name in like Sumiko Gurashi land? Cause I don't remember. Oh my gosh, it's a chocolate lollipop. A lot of you know that we lived in Japan when my daughter was really little and one of the things that she always wanted to stop by the convenience store and get was mommy chocolate lollipop. And it was these. It's literally just a piece of chocolate. It's not like an actual lollipop, like a sucker. It's just, you could bite it as a soft piece of chocolate on a stick and they made them in like a lot of different characters, Anpaman and different things. And she loved these. We have a little bag of panko, which I find strange. So you would like like breading, which is very cute. You can see tonkatsu on the front with ebi fry. And then this one's so weird. It's got like a little lid that's a sticker. Look, I can't tell what it's supposed to be. There was a whole bunch of the little things that I opened, but they were all ebi fry. So I don't know if this is supposed to be like shrimp snacks uh, or something like that. They're all in there. See, a whole bunch. And every one of those was a little fried shrimp snack. So I love snacks. All right. Next up, who is in here? I can tell that I got a penguin or the penguin. So this one is called cucumber. So this is like penguin, uh, penguin, like uh, in the vegetable section. This is so cute. I love these little vegetables. All right, this is penguin. Now, if you've never seen this character before, he in Japanese the word for penguin is penguin. But this character is penguin with a question mark, like penguin. <laughs> He's so cute. He's got his little hat on. 
Okay, I absolutely cannot do this. This tiny little stick is supposed to go in here, which is where the vegetables go. And I don't know if I need like tweezers and then this is supposed to go on there. It's just not working. Here's what it's supposed to look like. I cannot do this. Also, you're supposed to have glue, which I don't have. So I'm just gonna put these veggies in there. <laughs> Comes with a tiny little bottle of salad dressing, which is really adorable. It comes with a little plastic shopping bag, which is twice as big as any of the characters. I don't know what that's about, but this is the first time I haven't been able to, to get, get it right. So here's all of the little veggies in the box, you know, and it's supposed to kind of have this sign sticking up that they are 100 yen each. I just cannot, I can't get the sign to work. Box number four, fish. It just says fish. And they have Tokage doing the fish. Tokage is a lizard. Oh, look at all that fish. There's a fish cake and some soy sauce and some canned tuna. And, oh, oh, this is so cute. This one's got a, a bag too. Why do they have these huge bags? Like the bags are bigger than the characters. <laughs> See, like here is Tokage, who is absolutely adorable in his headband. And here's the bag that I could literally put him down in. There is literally a little piece of fish to go into the can. I didn't even notice. Look, there's fish in there. My adorable little blue fish on sale for $3.50. And a teeny tiny little fingernail size bottle of soy sauce. There's one I really, really am excited to get that I have not opened yet called Cart. I think that's what I just got. It is. You guys look, how cute is that? Who wants to ride in a Sumiko Gurashi cart? Cause I, I do. I absolutely do. Cutest one so far. Look at my little cart. Oh my gosh. I want this so badly. Like I, I want this in real life. <laughs> real life. It's so cute. Oh no. This little basket does not want to set on here. It doesn't have like, it needs probably a little dab of super glue. It came with two of the little tapioca. Tapioca. They, these are like little guys. They bounce around all through the Sumiko Gurashi world. Fantastic. We have a big bag of Japanese rice. I have to go to the Asian store like once every couple of weeks to buy a huge bag of rice. And then we have last a little box of potato sticks. It literally says potato sticks. So, which are delicious. I still haven't opened some katsu yet. I, I keep saying what I want to open and, and then I do. That is exactly what I got. It, this one's just called fried food. Fried food. I miss going to the Japanese grocery stores a lot. Look at tonkatsu. It's so cute. This is so cute. Now, if you don't know tonkatsu is a pork chop, that's literally what it means is fried pork chop. Uh, pork cutlet, basically. He's so cute. And it came with, it's so hard to show you guys all the little things. I will show you later. It came with a fried set. It has a croque. That's this round thing. Okay. It came with a croque a fried fish and a fried shrimp, which is ironically not Ebi Fry. I don't know. Cause Ebi Fry is a character, but this is just a real fried shrimp. And it actually came with a little takeout container as well. If you wanted to put the fried things in here. Last two boxes. So let's see who I don't have yet. I don't have the one called shopping basket and I don't have the one called flyer. Let's see if I can figure it out. That's who I got, flyer. Maybe it's just saying that this is the stuff that's on sale in the weekly flyer. I don't know, look, it's got like green tea and bread and, and uh, shirokuma, I don't know. Okay, so the little sausages were not easy to get in their bag, but here they are. I mean, I got them kind of in there. There's literally miniature wieners in there. I guess that's what we are going to make the little taco wieners out of. Comes with a, a pack of bread. I did not have to put this one together, so I don't understand why I had to put the other one together. A big large bottle of green tea. This is one of their big like liter bottles. And I've got a whole bunch of little coins here that are too small to show you. And I have a coin purse, but unfortunately it doesn't even open. I was hoping it would, it would be functional. I could put the coins in it. No luck. And here is Shirokuma and a cute little apron. All right, last box. <laughs> it's got a, like, it's got like a lettuce or a cabbage in it so cute and this one actually has ebi fry himself there's quite literally something in this set that i've never seen in my life and i don't know what it is okay i'm gonna try and show it to you it's really tiny uh can you see it it looks like a chicken nugget with 
a hook hanging out of it. It's on the paper. It's it's right there. So it's it doesn't like go with something else. I don't know what that is. I am at a loss. I don't know what that little, I don't know what it's supposed to be, you guys. If you know, please leave me a message because I am, I am clueless. I don't know. Look at Ebby Fry. He's so tiny. He's so cute. Can you see? There he is. He's so cute. Little fried shrimp. He's horrified that there is literally a fried shrimp in one of the other sets. This is so tiny. I can't see what it is. Like, I feel like I need some readers or something. Maybe I can blow it up in the camera. I don't know. I don't know what this is. I can't see it on the flyer or like on the checklist or here. I can't, I can't see what that is. I don't know what that is. There's a cabbage. It's gonna go in here. You guys, ah, oh, so cute. This actually works. <laughs> That's adorable. Got a little bottle of Sumiko Gurashi milk. That is also going to go in here, just like that. And a bottle of sauce. It literally just says sauce. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at everything that I got all together. Okay, let's take a look at everything that I got. <laughs> it is a lot. So this is the cart and the fishing and the sausages, that is so cute. The snacks, the veggie tray that I just couldn't get to work, that just didn't work out for me. This was the flyer, right? The flyer one, the fried food, and the shopping basket. Oh, they're all so cute. You guys have to let me know which of these sets was your favorite one. I think my favorite one, oh gosh, I can't pick. Probably the sausages, but also the cart is so cute. I don't know. They're all so super cute. All right, I can't wait to hear from you. Which one of these remits was your favorite? Sumiko Gurashi is like, uh, it's so cute. There's never a part of them that aren't cute. And so I, this is really hard to choose. Although remit is very fiddly little things. It ends up adorable. You can use it in so many setups. So please let me know which was your favorite. And if you haven't done so, please subscribe to Tanuki Junction and we will find our happy together. Bye guys.